support ourselves and our families, we all spend a good deal of our adult lives working. Life can be so much better if we enjoy that time. If you like to help others, want to stay in the community you love, and dream of a job with good pay and a bright future, Columbia Gorge Community College may offer just what you're looking for. The healthcare industry is an ever-growing field with many rewarding jobs for people with a wide variety of education levels. With a high school diploma or a GED and just a few classes at Columbia Gorge Community College, it's possible to begin working in a healthcare occupation. From there, some students continue to climb the health occupation's career ladder, taking more courses while they earn a living in the healthcare field. Others choose to attend school full-time to achieve their education goals faster. Regardless of the time it takes, all CGCC students enjoy the many benefits of attending a great school. Located right here in our own Mid-Columbia community. Travis and Paula are currently students in the nursing program at CGCC. They have families and have had other jobs, but now they've chosen to improve their lives by going back to school. I did office work for five years. I was an office manager and I, I enjoyed that, but I wasn't fulfilled. I wanted a profession where I could really feel like I was going to make a difference in someone's life. So when the school started the program, the nursing program here, I thought, oh, that's the fit, that's right, and so I enrolled. The classes are small enough that you can get individual attention, but they definitely have enough high-tech equipment that they can offer you the education that you really need to be competitive. The teachers are hugely supportive and I honestly feel that I can turn to them for help, advice, and I feel like they really want me to succeed. I don't think anybody should tell you that it's easy because it has definitely been difficult. It's a hard program and they do push you. And I really love going home, whether it's from class or clinicals in particular, and feeling good because I helped a patient. You'll get a great education. You'll learn to love the school and love your teachers. Health occupation students are making the most of CGCC's small class sizes, knowledgeable faculty, and cutting-edge learning strategies, like this state-of-the-art simulation lab. Students are given the opportunity to practice their skills with a very uh, close-to-real situation and setting. Good morning, Mr. McCann. I'm Paula. I'm one of your nurses today. High fidelity mannequins are used that can breathe and talk and have sounds of heart, lung, bowel. Behind the simulation lab is a control room and in the control room is a computer program that runs SimMan. Faculty are in there running his stats, changing his blood pressure, changing his heartbeat. They can give us lots of different situations, situations that we may not encounter until you know, a year or two out in the workforce, and you're able to practice the skills that you've learned, and if you're a little nervous about doing them, it's a little easier to do them on a mannequin, but a mannequin that's very realistic. And that'll help so I won't get pneumonia again? It's very exciting to be working in the Sims Lab. It totally takes you to a different level with working with patients. I think it's going to increase my knowledge tremendously. Strong partnerships with local healthcare facilities, including the Mid-Columbia Medical Center in the Dalles, get students out of the classroom and into the real world. We're an integral partner with our local health care providers and they're important to our program. We offer clinical rotations in three or four different departments from the emergency room to the uh, family birth center to med surge and the critical care unit. The clinicals are really beneficial and important because you get to really interact with patients. It's the real hands-on contact. The hospital works very hard to provide opportunity for them to have that experience. And it's important to see all aspects of nursing so that when you graduate or when I graduate that I have an idea of what I would like to do and what I'll be good at. Yes. 
The healthcare field offers a growing array of jobs that suit a wide variety of people and interests. Tony's training as an emergency medical technician helped him land a job with the Hood River Fire Department. When he's off duty, Tony plans to continue his career advancement through additional EMT training. Every time the bells go off and the dispatcher gets on and says, Hood River EMS respond to such and such an emergency, you, you never know what it's gonna be. To be a paramedic isn't, you don't just go to school for a year and you become a paramedic. You're, con you're basically in school for the rest of your life. You're constantly training and that's what I like about it. I decided I wanted to be a paramedic firefighter and in order to do that, I had to, there was a number of classes that I had to take before I could get into paramedic school. I chose Columbia Gorge Community College because it was close, convenient, and affordable and fit into my schedule. If the college didn't exist, I would have had to travel to Portland, I would have had to travel somewhere farther, much farther away, and it would have taken a lot longer for me to achieve my goal. Griselda's time at CGCC was the beginning of five years of effort for her and her family. Effort that has paid off with a job as a registered nurse at an assisted living facility. I'm the uh, head nurse here. Um, there's only one nurse, so I'm on call 24-7. It's a great experience. I have four years of background experience with um, family health. Today, it wouldn't be by Columbia Gorge. I, I didn't think I would have been where I am right now. They had evening classes. I was working during the daytime full time and then we're going to Columbia Gorge one or two classes at a time. I like small classes because of my language barrier. So my, um, I like small classes where the, the instructors take the extra time to just go one and one with the students. Now, Griselda is giving back to her school and her community by sharing her knowledge as an instructor at Columbia Gorge Community College. Through her example, she's showing her students the way to a great career in healthcare. And being a nursing is not just thinking about salary. Being a nursing comes from the heart. You have to love what you do and care for people. And one more. Across America, there is a growing demand for all types of skilled healthcare workers. There are many good living wage jobs available with flexible schedules and excellent benefits. Jobs that can help feed your family and nourish your soul. As our population ages, more and more health care is going to be needed. The nurses that are out there now are going to be retiring themselves. They're going to need replacements. There will always be a need for more and more health care workers in this society. There's small towns all across America that are actually drying up and dying because they don't have programs like this. We need to be able to educate the community within itself so people can stay here. It's a good way to offer education to kids coming out of high school as well as people like myself who are you know, 28 years old and just starting to go back to school because they realize they want to do something else. Do your schooling here, do it locally, and then get back to your community and help take care of those who have taken care of you. To climb the ladder of success in healthcare, it takes passion, hard work, and education. The first two are already inside you. And a great education's available right here in your own backyard at Columbia Gorge Community College. Find out more about a health occupations career at CGCC. Call us or visit us on the web.